What do you think you can bring to the Spartan studio? I, I promise, Susan, I, I can do this. I can do this. Oh, these are all the people you're going to be working with. Don't talk smack about Subline. They got me for some tough times. Sorry oh to the mind, too. Let me get you a. Um, I need to take this call, Antonio. Um, but um, go ahead and introduce yourself to the staff. I'm calling out your name. Hey, I am not sorry I'm late. Yeah, it's okay. It's just a welcoming party. It's not the first day. Yeah, I hate parties though. Yeah, how lame. Socializing. Is that sarcasm? I don't appreciate it. Sorry. It's my only way of socializing. Nah, I was just joking. I, I like the sarcasm. Well, I'm glad that you're here. And I mean that without any sarcasm. Oh, thanks. It's really nice of you. Well, I'm gonna go play with some people about the panels over there. Yeah. Okay. Oh. What's your name again? Oh, it's uh, it's Antonio. What's yours? Oh, it's Charlie. Uh, oh. Here's to co-worker Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. All right. So, see you. All right, guys. So, after that welcoming party yesterday, uh, it's time to discuss what we're going to work on together, collectively. So, uh, what I was thinking was like a variety show where we like do whatever we kind of feel like. Like one day we could do a game show, or we could do a skit or a short film. You know, just trying to show off our talents and really put ourselves out there, entertain people. That's what I was thinking. What, what do you guys think? The idea sounds a little vague, but hear me out. I think the more we do it, the more footing we'll get. So I like it. Thanks, Sarah. I don't like it. I prefer something more structured. Oh, dude, let's do one with me and Hangry in a show, in a prank show, you know? And like messing up with people, you know? Like messing around, you know? I mean, I could be a segment. Maybe even an episode, but I don't know if that's the best idea. That sounds, I don't even know what's going on, but that sounds good in my book. Wait, I don't have a book. In, in my brain? Uh, uh, yeah. Yeah, there you go, Gina. I knew you were smart, not to mention you're funny too. <sighs> yeah, thanks, Gina, I'm so awesome. I get what you're going for and it sounds good. My oh only suggestion. Nobody cares, Emma. Just say it's good and leave it at that. Hey, that was a little rude, miss. Why are you calling miss? Uh, so, uh, what do you think of the project, Charlotte? Oh, um, sounds good to me. All right. Well, I think what we should do first is a werewolf skit in high school so we could parody tropes and, you know, really show off some skill through it. That'll be our first project. Charlotte, it's time to shut the place down and go, you know, home? Oh, yeah, um, let me just save my edits and close this off. You know, uh, I know this one place sells good Chinese food, and, uh, I wouldn't mind some company. Um, sorry, I, I'm not interested. I mean, it, it doesn't have to be romantic, it could just be friendly. Yeah, but that was your intentions. You were just too scared to say it. Right, I'll see you later, Charlotte. Yeah. Okay. Bye. Tony. Did you remember our first segment? It was so funny. Everything was working against our favor. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah, I remember, Henry. How could I forget? Oh, 
Sir, the camera's not working. The Gina says she's been trying to figure it out, but she can't fix the problem. And the werewolf costume, Ben says he can't see out of it. Daisy, she's been daily by her lines, and we can't find Henry anywhere. What? He's crucial to the scene. He, he said he would be here today. Where is he? I, I don't... card isn't even in. The camera's not even oh. Whatever. Just frame your shots right. You want to do that, right? Mm -hmm. And then hit the record button. Okay. Yeah, I got that. All right, how do I... The red button, Gina. The red button. Oh. Okay, everybody, I got Henry. All right. Action! Stacy, stay away from me! You, you, you are walking a beast inside of me! I really thought, I thought it would change things, but I still, I just, I can't, I can't do it. I'm not confident. I can't. Hey, whoa, 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 don't start talking like that now. You, everything may not go your way, and that's okay. You know, the, the universe works in really weird ways, but you're gonna get through this. You're doing what you can, and that's all that matters. You'll be okay. Thank you. Uh, yeah, no problem, dude. That's a lot. Hey, uh, Charlotte, I think you're really cool, and I'd like to get to know you more. I think you'd want to go out sometime. I'm, I'm so sorry. I, I don't see you in that way. Yeah. You're cool, though. But, uh, Okay, I'll see you. Damn, rejected twice? Ay, Jesus. Yeah, it's alright. Sometimes people just don't connect, you know? That's it happens. Yeah. I'm tired, okay? I'm directing people who are incompetent. I can't do this. Do, do you just love watching me fail? Is that what this is? Is my misery just a show to you to put on other people's folks? Is, is that what our agreement was? Because I thought I was trying to do something good. Something that would take me somewhere. Something that would change my life. 
But all it has been is a charade. And it's just been trying and failing and trying and failing and trying and failing. And I'm tired, Susan. I'm really tired. I'm like Sisyphus rolling up an endless boulder that just comes back and squashes me. Well, it seems to me that you're just not doing a good job. And you want to blame it all on me. So, uh, don't worry, Antonio. I will be the one to end your so-called suffering. <laughs> yeah, you're fired. Damn, so you got fired? How'd yeah. you feel about that? Bad at first, then I felt like I lost my only chance at happiness. Like really having a purpose. Yeah, I was lost for a while, just wandering around, wondering if I lost it all, just in a sea, I guess. I didn't know what to do. Then after a while, I started feeling better. I started being more at peace. I was happy that I was away from that environment. And that I was done. I'm just, I'm happy I tried. It's so weird that Antonio just left like that with no reason, not even telling us anything. And now Emma's in charge? I mean, I feel like if he asked me one more time to go on a date, I feel like I would have given him a chance. You know, I started writing a script, got into college, so I finally did that after two years of just being a high school graduate. Now that Emma's in charge, I kind of miss Antonio. Um, I don't think I'll be in Spartan Rick that much longer. I think it's okay where I'm at now. I think I needed the rest. Did you learn anything from this? And sometimes things don't go your way. But that's fine. Things happen. <laughs> and trying and failing and trying. Okay, okay, I can. And action. Oh no, Stacy, stay away from me. Oh my God. I, I will get a uh, beat.